Thank you, Hunter. Well, earning A's all four years of high school is a goal some students try to achieve. And for one Peach County senior, losing his spot at the top of his class just wasn't an option. Our Kayla Solomon introduces us to our great grad Desmond Pastor and his hurdles to the finish line. Some students aim for the top of their class. For Desmond Pastor, he didn't even know he was at the top of his class until his sophomore year. Then one day in the hallways, the students came to me, they were asking my name. I told them my name and they were like, you're the uh, valedictorian. I was like, um, you sure? <laughs> that moment would be the start of a new mission to graduate as number one. I think having that shown to me and seeing what I could do it influenced my drive to want to be about the story. Along the way, a lot of people helped keep him on the right track. I feel like my baby has just grown up. <laughs> like Miss Mauricia Gregory, his business teacher. Desmond has potential and that I see that he hasn't even discovered yet in himself. So I know he's going to be greater than what he is now. Desmond also relies on his family, especially because he's attended nine different schools. With my dad being a basketball coach, you know, coaches get opportunities all the time. And so ever since elementary school, really, I've moved schools almost every year. Not really every year, but sometimes every other year. His dad coached at Peach County High for three years, allowing Desmond to settle in until October when Coach Pralvis Pastor suffered a stroke at practice. He always worked out, always went to the gym, you know, ate right, you know, had a good diet. And so I was just like, you know, how could this happen to such a good person, you know? Desmond took on a whole new routine, mornings in class, afternoons in the hospital or at home. If I didn't have work after my second period, I would try to go home and ask my mom, you know, hey, does my dad need help with anything? Do I have to take him to therapy this day? Um, there were some days that I actually had to, you know, miss school to help my mom out because she had to go to work and I would have to take him to therapy, so. Now, eight months later, his dad's health is improving and Desmond is ready for the next chapter, a full ride at Alabama State. You may have to work harder than others, but that just makes it, you know, you cherish it more. And you know, at the end of the day, after you get the goal accomplished, you're like, okay, I did this, so let me move on, I can get a bigger goal. His next goal, graduating college with his father in the stands. In Peach County, Kayla Solomon, 13 WMAZ News. Well, both of my parents graduated from Alabama <laughs> State University, so I think he chose very wisely. He will get a wonderful education there. <laughs> Pastor plans to study computer information systems and minor in political science. I know he has a bright future ahead he of does. him. Best of luck for him. Can't wait to see all the great things he does. And congrats to all of our yes. grads out there. I know we highlighted a couple this week, but it's we're very proud of all of you. exciting time. I graduated high school 11 years ago today. It's oh, yes. <laughs> 12 years. It's been a long time, but it's still a very exciting time. Something you do remember. So Always, always. Well,